Miami. We're stuck out here. This wasn't supposed to happen, but we're here now. So first stop, we're going to Snipes. We're gonna see what they got. And I gotta hit the stores around the city. It's gonna be interesting, let's, let's go ahead. So because of copyright reasons, we're gonna have to do a quick voiceover for you guys. The music was blasting in there and honestly, they were playing a bunch of bangers. But hopefully you guys can see right here, they have a ton of DJ Khaled fives in both colorways. But you know, we gotta start it off hot with the all black Air Force Ones. My dad be loving the black forces, so I had to <laughs> expose them a little bit. Now right here, we got the LeBron Animal Print Twos. Again, a crazy sample that I'm surprised that is sitting on shelves. The LeBron 4 as well, all black in the graffiti version. And then we got the Neapolitan 11s. When it comes to the women's section over here, we got the satin breads, we got the threes, we got the twos, the ones, a lot of different options. And it's crazy seeing the UNC to Chicago. Now in the kids section over here, we still got some gratitude 11s. I was looking for an adults pair, but I couldn't find any. And then on some more kids sizes right here, we got the black toe ones. And you know, Cali got kids, so what that means. There's gonna be a bunch of kids pairs available as well. And these baby gratitudes, those are so clean. Now the pandas, I've always been interested. How much are they in your city? These are 115 bucks. I have seen pairs at $110, but it looks like most pairs are going to 115. Over here, we got the Chicago twos, which is crazy because those have been out for over a year. Brotherhood ones, you see a bunch of different options right here, Royal Reimagines. Some more twos, fives, crafts. Got the Aqua sixes and some Toro sixes over here. And you know, I love this shoe. But it's funny because every time I go somewhere to get this shoe, it's always available, but never in my size. 200 bucks, it ain't bad, I get it. But this is something I still need to add to my collection. I didn't grab these last year and I low-key forgot to mention those. Got some items over here on sale, 20% off. Right here, you got the Chambray 7s. Again, this is a very beautiful and nostalgic shoe for me because I used to have these back in high school. So personally, I like those. Now the 7s below those, uh, yeah, we're gonna pass on that one. We're just gonna skip right past that. Now we got some more pairs over here and it's interesting to see right here. We, we talked about these in the past, 140 bucks with 20% off. If I didn't have these already, I probably would have grabbed them, but I actually ended up getting a different shoe on this wall. This shoe, 100 and forty dollars with twenty percent off. I don't know about you, but I've been wanting these for a while, and I had to pick them up. Very, very happy camper one in that one. Now, looking at DJ Khaled's office, as you can see on the inside, they built out an office. He actually does show up sometimes, and over here he has different PEs from Russell Westbrook. But this is the big one right here, J Balvin threes. Oh my gosh, these are so clean. These are crazy. Got the Carhartt 4 sitting next to them too, I forgot about that. But either way, back to those threes, that's just crazy. Now, Gator 4s, UNC 4s, makes sense. Jordan, Florida, different things like that. You got his blue threes and his red threes right here. Not all three versions when it comes to the suede, the leather, but just a couple versions of that. And then over here, you got the blue fives and the purple fives. Now you guys know I've done a review on these back before they had came out and had seen the public eye. So if you guys wanna check that video out, it'll be linked down below as well for you guys. Great shoes, Soulfly makes sense. Two beautiful sneakers. You got some Legend of Summers, Justin Timberlake's and the 85 Chicago ones, beautiful. Oh yeah, shout out the Ducks, go Ducks baby. Air Max is in the eights and that is a look at his office. Shout out to Snipes, shout out to DJ Khaled. I ended up grabbing those one lows. Got them on sales like a hundred bucks. So we're on our way to the mall to go check out another shoe store. And then I thought about it. The Dolphins are playing the Bills tonight in Miami. So you know what that means. We gotta go to the game.
11 seconds left before half. The Bills are down by a touchdown. They're trying to score right now. Let's see what happens. Some water, and every time we go somewhere, he always got to get some popcorn. So, every time he got some popcorn, and we also ran into JC. Shout out to him. So, uh, let's get back to our seat and watch the rest of this game. He's looking me up. What's that mean? Uh oh. That's me on the top. Is it? Yeah, that's me. Definitely me. <laughs> Are you serious? Yes. Are you about to watch my story? Where are you from? Portland. Oh, you told me that. Portland, Oregon. Yeah, yeah I told you earlier. <laughs> I get to sign your shirt, too? <laughs> so you're not even down here. Oregon. You're just down here. To... I'm just out here for a good time. You're just sneaking in. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> sneaker. Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he just ran it back. He just ran it back. Oh my god! Yeah, right. What? What? Oh. Wow, what a game. 
definitely glad we pulled up. This is crazy. Yo, if y'all enjoying this, man, hit that subscribe button. We still got, we might have to go out tonight too and hit the hard rock, but we're gonna go sneaker shopping tomorrow. You know, I told y'all, we're gonna go. Don't worry, I got y'all. This is what I was looking for all day. Go Steelers. Yes, Go Steelers. Steelers. That's what I'm fucking talking about. I accidentally came to the game. I wasn't supposed to be here. My mistake. My flight got canceled. Oh, no way. So we came to the game. Shit, so now no we're going to go home tomorrow. But I was supposed to leave this morning. Take care of this but either way, Go Steelers. Yeah, man. Go Steelers. Sure. Uh, we're slowly making our way out of here. There's a lot of Bills fans, huh? It's crazy. All right. I'm officially a Bills fan. For the next 20 minutes. Like 20 minutes, see the shirt. You see the shirt. You see what it says. See that right there? I ain't gonna lie. Josh Allen got me a lot of points at fantasy football, and then won me some championships. So I can't say I'm not a fan. <laughs> hey, and Diggs is cold too. Shout out to Jordan Boyer too, my dog. All right, you know what time it is. Gotta hit the casino and see what they talking about over here. Another day at the office. I turned 100 bucks into 500 bucks, baby. Let's go. Welcome back. We are back to our regular scheduled programming and it's time to go sneaker shopping. It's the next day, but bear with me. I heard there's a lot of stores in this mall. We're at the Aventura Mall. So let's see what we can find. First stop, Champs. What you got for your boy? Uh-oh, I see it right here. The shoe that you love oh so much. That's my shoe right there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What's the retail on these again? 180? These are worth about a hundred bucks. They put these up here to get people to come in the store. That's what they did. That's what they or did. maybe they wanted to repel them away uh, from the store. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I like those. I like those. They just weren't in my top 10. That's it. That's it. Starting off hot right here. Last video I accidentally said the Jubilees, these are the Gratitudes. I know, I know. I was talking fast, you know, a lot going on. I was in New York, I was overwhelmed. I've been seeing these at all the stores. What do you think about these? Trash. I think the colorway though, I feel like they're kind of solid. For you? I don't no, know, for a little hoop shoe, you know what I'm saying? Something crazy, something flashy. Just, I'm not mad at it, I'm not mad at it. The Mellow Ball. The Mellow Ball got some bangers. I, I don't know, good. all his stuff is kind of sitting though. You see everything, just 100 bucks now. Oh, they got the black cement. Th oh, never mind. Oh, they got the fire red three. Oh, never mind. But they do have the chambray sevens. Okay, okay. 200 bucks though. Please don't spend more than $120 on this shoe. Fear threes, chilling. Okay, okay. We got the navy threes. Okay. More reimagines. Got the wheat 13. Solid. But wait for these. Get these on sale too. When you was looking for these them. are so trash. He wanted these bags. These are terrible. Now you read naked. I don't know if you guys saw, but shoes like this made Jordan Brand a billion dollars already. Oh. Just off of sneakers like this. Crazy. You rocking with the Asics or what? Kicking it old school? I ain't gonna lie, it's still a pass for me. These are a lot better though. Look comfy too, but still a pass. Oh, here you go. All black. Oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> he pulled up the airbag. She used to rock with the forces too. <laughs> All right, next up we got Foot Locker. Let's see what they got inside. Come on, I hope y'all got something a little bit better. All right, Royal Reimagines, chilling. I don't know the colorway of these, but <laughs> they be having these at all the stores. Low top ones, okay, solid. Still think uh, 140 is too much for this shoe. Got the 11 lows right here. You like this shoe. I know you like this shoe right here. This one of the most comfortable I still shoes. just don't buy it for retail though. Let it go on sale. Aqua 60s, fire. These are crazy. I love this shoe right here. Okay, they got the Burgundy 5s. Solid. Again, probably catch it on sale though. Black and white 14s, Michael Finley PE, turned into a GR. Solid, catch it on sale. These are on sale in some stores, not here. These will probably go on sale. These might go on sale too. I love this shoe though. These things are amazing. Oh, it's also funny because my dad was hating on these and now he's like, actually, these are kind of cool. I did hate on this shoe at first, <laughs> but now like I've been looking at it, it's kind of wearing on me. <laughs> She was pretty fire if you ask yeah. me. You want these? I want these bad. Yeah, you're gonna have to spend your own money on ah. those. <laughs> Not today, <laughs> but I will get you these. And I won't wear those. <laughs> All right, they got some dunk options over here. 115 bucks, okay, solid. Okay, we are, you know, we, I don't even need to say nothing. I don't even need to say nothing. Bringing back some nostalgic vibes over here for the 100 bucks. Honestly, that's cool. That's really good vibe. Got the LeBron Force. LeBron. Crazy, nice. crazy. This is another one I've been talking about, y'all. Low key, I don't know, I keep seeing these and I'm like, I feel like I'll, I might wanna add these to my collection. I think this might be a good hoop shoe right here. They probably thought if you add this little exclusive tab, people were gonna wanna have it in their arsenal, but I uh, guess that didn't work. One brand that a lot of people are sleeping on when it comes to sneaker heads in particular, on. 
These are light. Everybody loves these shoes. They're taking charge. It's so crazy. Like, these are some good shoes. Again, I know I may not meet your style aesthetics and everything, but comfort and everything, great shoe. Uh, 160. Not bad, right? Solid, solid. Bro, I didn't realize that this shoe right here is $85. That's crazy. For the kids section, we got some 13s over here. That was my thing right here. Look at the hologram. There's no hologram. At least this one has a hologram on it. Got the Cherry 13s. Ooh, playoff eights. Okay, solid. If you get your kid these, he's a menace. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. All right, we got the women's twos, the high top over here. We got the Gore-Tex 60s, satin ones. Another pair of ones over here. Got some solid options in the women's section. I'm not mad at it. Okay, so I heard there was a Nike store in here. So you know what that means. We gotta go check it out and see if they got any heat up in there. They do have an Adidas store too. Should we go in? Let's give them a chance. <laughs> these are solid. I like these right here. I'm not mad at this at all. Especially these ones right here fire all right looks like we got some collabs up in here as well okay okay we see some of these in Foot Locker but not all of these in the Foot Locker locations hey this looks kind of clean okay I like how they did that I like how they did that what else we got down here materials on these is kind of solid yeah these go crazy these are smooth yeah I like these a good job with those. here we have it the sneaker of 2024 I guarantee you everybody's gonna be rocking these this summer Watch, it's gonna happen. You're gonna see everybody rocking these on TikTok, you name it, this is gonna be the shoe. And then all the people that are like, nah, I don't wear Sambas, they're gonna be like, I wear these. <laughs> it's like, bro, they look like the same shoe, I get it, they're different, but a lot of people's gonna be wearing these too. There we go, now we talking, home baby. As soon as I walk in the store, I'm in love. Now I was playing, this store, this store is cool, it's all right, it's all right. Let's see if they got some heat though. You like these? I do like that. You like those? Yeah. Out of everything, that's what you like. Not everything. <laughs> I'm forever gonna call these the gratitude one mids. <laughs> oh man. Honestly though, these are solid though. These are solid. I'm not mad at these. I got some mids up here. I, I got some more those. options. You a rock those? I'll rock those. You a rock those? Okay. I know you'll rock these. What else we got right here? Alright. We got some fear threes up in here. Solid. Okay. Everything pretty standard a lot Ooh. of the stores. The twos. Ooh. What do you think about these? This is clean. You like man. those? The leather's nice. Remember I told you the leather's yeah. nice on these? Well, Crazy, huh? How about? Solid, solid yeah. shoe. And then you got this one right here. These are clean too. Oh, yep, yep. Nice and smooth. See, this easy. is, you, see, you do your reviews online and then you see the shoe in person. I know, it's like, I hate that. You know, actually, it's a little bit better. It is, because you can feel it. Solid. And it's like that Chicago, like early OG color blocking, just a little splash of green. I'm not mad at it. Yeah. Who remembers when the duck boots first came out back in the day? It's crazy to see them coming back. Fire shoe. All right, we got some dunk options up in here. Everything is 115 bucks. Standard retail price now. What you guys think about these colorways? Kicking it old school. Okay. I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that. Another shoe that you're gonna see a lot of people rocking this year, straight off of style and comfort, yes. Beautiful shoe. All right, looks like there's a hole upstairs. So uh, let's see what they got up here. I'm assuming it's like the women's section. And it is bright and clean up here. It looks so good. Honestly, I like the look of this store. This is nice. Downstairs, a little dark, a little dingy, you know? Upstairs, looks really good. We know these are gonna be sitting here. We see these in every store. 225, nobody wants to pay that for these. I get it, maybe 150 bucks. These for short people? Those for short people? I'm for short people. Well, based off of my knowledge, most women are shorter than men. So that might be a thing too. Oh my God. They like to wear heels and other things. So yeah, good, I think it. it makes sense. <laughs> Another one right here, chilling. A lot of hype before they came out. Now look at it, sitting everywhere. Vortex sixes, I think, you know, it's just an acquired taste type of thing. I see what they're doing here. We're in the women's section. All white forces can never go wrong. Quick look at the kids section. Same thing right here when it comes to the retros. A couple options. The bedazzled Air Maxes. Yes, bedazzled Air Those Max. are trash. Get these for the wife. Those are trash. <laughs> she loves them. Never. <laughs> This right here is the sneaker I've been waiting to see you tell me what you think about these right here. I should never try this again. <laughs> I should not ever do this. These are <laughs> hot buns. They blew it. These are so trash. I can't believe they wasted the time to actually make this. 
you know, it's for a different audience. It's for a different audience and different graphic. I don't know who because they haven't sold out yet, so they, they haven't found the audience yet. yet. <laughs> but y'all know, I said it before, if they did a Craig Sager Air Jordan 5, it'd be like a $20,000 shoe. Not probably not 20,000, but at least like a $7,000 shoe. If it was like an exclusive like PE, you know, one of 12 pairs or something like that, I guarantee you that's what would happen. Out of the three stores that we went to so far, four stores, I don't know, DJ Khaled, Nike, Foot Locker Champs, what are, uh, what do you rank them? I think uh, Khaled was number one. Okay. Nike, two. Okay. Adidas, three. Oh, I forgot about Adidas. Champs, four. What about Foot Locker? That was downstairs. Oh. Champs was better, or Foot Locker was better than Champs. Foot Locker was, yeah, yeah, yeah. So Champs Foot was Locker last? Better Champs. Okay. Yeah. Well, there's JD Sports over here. Loki, every time I've been in the malls and stuff, JD Sports has been like the best one. Okay. So we're gonna see. We'll we're see. see. Yeah. Uh -oh. So this is JD Sports right here. We don't have one of these back home, but they're in like a lot of other cities. So check it out. Let me know what you think. Let's see what the inventory is looking like. What kind of shoes they got today? First thing I'd like to say is the AC is on point today. I'm already gassing them up. All right, starting off hot. We got the pandas. We got the women's twos. We got the Gore-Tex sixes. We got some more one options over here. Whoa, they did like the distress leather. Like on the PEs and stuff, like the Amas, similar. Okay, interesting. Those are kind of cool color pattern. I'm gonna pass on that one. <laughs> Got the Air Max Ones on sale, 120 bucks. This is cool. I like these. Basic color blocking can never go wrong. Just switch the color. Again, hard to fill. These are the new Lebrons, and they're on sale. This is pretty clean, though. You like those? I actually like this shoe. You gonna get buckets in these? 170 bucks? No, oh, I might catch a cramp. <laughs> <laughs> See what they got on the sale rack. Bro, they got the bread of Oh, wait, never mind. Damn. All right, got the Kraft Olive Fours up in here. A lot of people slept on these. Good shoe. I get it. Retail price is kind of high, though. Do you want to pay that much? I don't know. Either way, nice shoe for the collection. Got some Wheat 13s down here, too, looking solid. They got that bread toe one low retro. I don't like the cut. Can't do it. Here we go. Another sleeper. Solid shoe right here. I like this colorway too. You can never go wrong with the black and white or just like neutral right here. The all tan. These are clean too. I'm what old. What you man. looking at over here? I'm old man. I would wear these. Those are so trash. Look, for the 80. I would slap you both ways. Hey, I'm gonna all get four two. ways. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna Up, down, left, and right. I'm gonna get these in blue. Hell no. <laughs> I can't let you walk with me in the mall I'm for the rest of the day. The <laughs> He's not any all of them. 80 bucks. Effort. <laughs> I keep seeing these around and I'm telling you, this shoe is clean, bruh. I like these a lot. We got some dunk options over here. Some different colors. Up. Wow, honestly, I'm surprised they have these colorways still available. That's crazy. Okay, 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 okay. I've been, I've, I've been seeing a lot of people wearing these lately too. I'm not that big of a fan of those, but I remember when it, this, I feel like these came out a while ago. Did these like re-release or something? For the 90, you cop in? For the 90, that's not bad. You're not gonna wear those. I wouldn't. I know. <laughs> Damn, they got the Odell backup knowledge nah, playing. <laughs> hey, if you know, you know, Odell Air Force One PE, crazy shoe. But honestly, this is cool though. They got the Navy 3s up in here in the other case. Another solid shoe, but wait for it to go on sale. Fan favorite, the Vomero 5. Everybody's rocking these this year. I can guarantee it. Oh, they got the Chicago 1 on sale. Oh, never mind. Wait, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. My bad. My bad. Oh, yeah. By the way, I made sure that we didn't go to the mall that had the aliens in it. Rumors of aliens invading Miami are going viral on social media. This is for real, folks. The conspiracy theory stems from a large police presence at Bayside Marketplace. Take a good look at your screen. Are those aliens walking in front of Bayside Marketplace in downtown Miami? Online conspiracy theorists are saying that shadowy figure, not far from parked Miami police cars, appears to be an alien. So this looks like a resale shop called Kick Essentials. Let's see what they got up in here. Blade case in the front window. You got some off-white, some Kobe, some Travis's. Ah, the year of the rabbits. I need them. All right, so this is what the wall looks like on the inside. I see some Dornbecker 3s up there. Okay, okay. Everybody's talking about the Ama 5s. They're like, bro, why don't you like the Ama 5s? I like them. They're cool. I'm just not like gassing them up like that. This is another shoe I missed out on, but I still need to add these to my collection. Okay, they got the Power Puffs up in here. Soul Flies. You're the rabbits. This is shoe I've been talking about, y'all. I still need to get these, but I'm telling you right now, in my size, they be taxing. All right, you guys, we're at the Nike Miami. We had to make a quick pit stop and grab some food at the mall. And then now we're over here. They got other shops and stuff, but 
we gotta wrap this up soon we still gotta get back home take care of business so let's go ahead and check out this store and see what they got they got the mannequin set up with all the lebrons he said he needs some lebrons in his life i do i want some <laughs> <laughs> these ones right here you like those? I like those. You like those. All right, let's see what they got. This is a pretty nice looking store. They said the women's shoes over here, so let's go check that out. They got the 11s chilling right here. $225 plus tax. Ooh, that's kind of high. Got a lot of running shoes on this side, some dunks and stuff over there. Training, training shoes. A lot of people like these. A lot of people like these. Got some pandas up in here, black and white. Let's see what other colors. They got the Air Max ones. Another dunk right here. This one's solid right here. Honestly, I'm not mad at these. Check out the materials. I thought this was like snake skin at first, but it's like a raised material on some areas, but it's not like stingray either. Interesting, with the gum bottom, it's not even a gum bottom, it's like a brown. What do y'all think about these? Let me know. I've been seeing these in more spots as well. Saw this at like shoe palaces and stuff like that. Interesting colorways, I'm not sure about this one. In Miami, they got the MIA over here with the Nike logo. This is kind of fire. Right, let's go upstairs and see what they got. As Soon as we get upstairs, you know they got that Miami heat gear on deck. Uh, it's cool. A shoe that I have seen available everywhere. A classic, the pennies, bro. These things go so crazy. I think it's just a $200 price point and people don't understand the nostalgia and everything behind it. So it's causing the shoe to sit, and I get it. All right, we got the LeBrons, we got the KDs, we got the Jaws. Got some solid stuff over here, but I see a section right here that says, find a few styles. This looks like it might be my size. Oh no, it's a 10 and a half. I was about to say, I'd have had the cop. You know I love me some sixes. They got the red Oreo sixes up in here. Okay, okay. What else they got up over here? One low, some dunks. Satins, burgundies, more stuff. Okay, okay. Some solid options. I ain't mad at it. This is a clean colorway. Can never go wrong with that. Here it is. They got the Gratitude 11s. Chilling. They got adult sizes. Chilling. <laughs> oh man, I didn't think I was going to see these out here. They've been kind of sold out everywhere, but they got pairs over here and they got kids pairs too. Dang, so this is the only store in Miami that I've seen so far that has this shoe. Interesting, interesting, okay. This, I still need this in the adults version. I still need these. What else they got over here? Some solid options. Everything similar to the other stores. It's actually funny because this is a men's shoe, but it's in the women's section. I feel like they're like holding it out or something. Like we kind of got men's shoes over here too though. Maybe it's kind of like all in the same thing. Cause those are like women's shoes kind of scattered dang these are still available these like been kind of sat for a while but then like sold out burgundy fives what else you got over here week 13s okay a lot of similarities but definitely differences at each store i like this because it's not the same stuff at every single store uh what else oh no i seen the display over here it's crazy how much the oh, shoe has faded because of the light and everything it took the infrared away from it you got your Nike Air on the back right there. Air Jordan 1, Air Jordan 1, <laughs> 1991 for the Air Jordan 6s, 1992 for the 7s, 93 for the 8s. This is dope, so damn, look at these 11s. Look at the patent leather. It's like matted. It's like taken away from everything just because of the light. I'm sure the sun has yeah. sure just beat these things up, causing them to yellow like crazy. But they got the display of like all the sneakers that he won championships in. All these different versions right here. More sixes over here. Sevens, eights right there. Pretty dope little display. Some nostalgic vibes. They got the photos to go along. You guys can see right there. They got the photos that go along with the shoes for when he was wearing them. The last shot, dope. I, it's crazy though, because why do they not have the 13s? Like I know they emphasize the other shoes, but like they gotta put the 13s in the mix too, if you ask me. Black Romero 5s, this right here. Lightweight menace activity, but they're probably comfy. Air Max 1 going crazy over here. What y'all think about these? Let me know down below in the comment section. 
160 bucks, is it a cop? I say it all the time, you can never go wrong with a clean Air Max One with this color block, especially the black and white. Yeah, these are fire. So I just asked them about the Gratitude 11s. And we got some news for you guys. They only have a size 10 and a half and under. And remember how I said before, yes, the shoe is always available, but it's available, but in the smaller sizes. 12, 13, 14, 15, that stuff be selling out when the shoe comes out. So yeah, we might see these sitting on shelves and we talk about it all the time and people say, oh, they're bricks and all those different things. But trust me when I tell you, every single time I go into the stores, what happened? This is 10 and under, nine and a half, 10 and a half, something like that. It'd be a struggle out here for us with the big feet, bruh. All right, you guys, that's a wrap. Time to go home. We'll see you guys in the next video. If you guys like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, we out. I would never let you down, it's in my DNA hey, The hey, only choice I like to make what I'ma wear today one one I would never let you down, it's in my DNA The only choice I like to make what I'ma wear today I was made for it, it's in